Today I had a nice trade. I actually came late into the trading session. I had a doctor's appointment. So I started about an hour later than I normally would. And I think it actually was kind of nice and helpful. Um, I, it was able to come after the downward move had already happened and we were starting to round out a little bit. And so being able to see the market from a fresh perspective and clean view uh, was actually really helpful for me today. And so I was able to take a long and uh, make some money off it. So please sit back and enjoy the stream recap as we go over that trade. Good morning. Happy Monday. A little, uh, a little late start here today, obviously. Looks like we had a nice little melt to the downside so far, putting some volume in around 985. Overall, just a nice little sell off. Uh, putting in this volume here does make me wonder like what's going to happen. A little delta divergence here at 13K. Congrats on 100K. Yes. Ah, oh, first stream back. 100K. It happened. Shout out. Thank you all. Um, so I like stayed up because I wanted to watch it top tick. Like I wanted to watch it go from 9,000 or 99,999 to 100K. It went to nine, nine, 99,999 and I was like, okay, I have my phone up. I was taking a picture and all of a sudden it just goes down by like 30 and I was like, what the hell? Went to bed and I woke up and I was like, a, mil a million feels possible. <laughs> and so since then, I've literally just been like, what type of videos can I make that are both helpful, I feel good about, and could also be like fun and entertaining to watch? Fun stuff. Fun stuff. All right. Yeah, it's got a little double top here. Uh, 162 did not get filled out. Rolling back to the lows. I feel like this is pretty standard action that we're seeing right here. Uh, if we sell off all morning, we put end up putting in that volume. We kind of range out here at the lows a lot of times for a couple hours around this time. And I think that's kind of what's happening here. I'm getting long here. Long at the lows. I like the bounce on 53. If we like really like aggressively start making new lows, I'll obviously kill this trade, but I do like this sort of price action typically. ES is a little spooky. Kind of a flat looking uh, prior low. Nice little sweep. Sweep run of the lows on the NAS. ES obviously didn't quite do it. That still looks pretty good. 1.8% down on the ES, 2.4 almost down on the NAS. It is always pretty interesting coming in a little late, like a little after the market's open and you've had some decent moves. It's always interesting to come in and like essentially clean slate it, you know, like you get a clean, clean look at everything. Value rotation would put us up at uh, 1337 as of right now. Uh, VWAP sitting at 1350. I'm looking at the little front run of point of control so far at 85, 86, I guess is technically point of control. That's what I'm looking at. Just front running that just a hair. We get it close up there i'll be killing my trade but yeah we're just kind of losing some downside steam here so i'm i'll be curious to see if we can make the rotation up es is trying to it looks like all right yes is up here at the top of the short term range i guess we'll call it um now is kind of rolling off of it i am going to be a little careful here buyers look pretty good but i also don't want to just watch this roll all the way back into like 50s i'm gonna go ahead and just put in a stop here See if we can continue this move to the upside, but I am getting a little close to calling it. I'll move this up and that way we can at least see like what's gonna happen at volume, but I'm gonna keep a very close eye on it. Cause as of right now, this candle looks a lot weaker than, than we had. And the ES is right at the top of the range. We got 45 seconds left on this candle. If this thing flips red, I don't really like it, which it's seeming like it's trying to do. Good enough for me. Took 255 out of that. I think PL high was like 400. Um, drawdown in that trade was like 200 bucks. But I, uh, this time of day, specifically like the 10 to noon hours, I feel like we end up just like chopping out a lot. So there's plenty of reason for me to think that we're going to do that. So that's why I took it off. If we continue to pump, guess what? I can get back in. <laughs> 